Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you a neat little tool for collaboratively creating maps. It's called EtherMap. You'll find it at getethermap.org. And you can simply go to the site, put in the name of your map. I'll call this one MLB Teams. Hit Create Map. And on the next screen, we'll be ready to start mapping things. Now, watch the wants to know my location I can allow it or block it I'll block it in this case and I'm gonna do a search for a location let's do Boston Massachusetts and I can zoom in or zoom out as much as I need and pan around now let's go and hit add marker I'm gonna add my marker right here I'm gonna call it Red Sox Red Sox play in Boston, their home stadium is Fenway Park. Now from here I can add in links, but I can't add in any pictures or any videos that are going to play back in this place marker. It simply will be a link to an external site. I can choose the color for my icon mar marker and hit add marker and now it's there on my map and I can zoom in more or less as needed. Now if I want to share the map with other people, just hit the share button and anyone who has this link has access to not only view the map but add more things to it. But if you go into your map settings, you can set a password for your map. So I'll set my password on this one. And now people will be required to enter the password that I've set in order to view and or edit this map. So that's how you can create a map using EtherMap and invite other people to work on it with you. It's a really simple tool and a great way to start making your own map. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out practicaledtech.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.